And first tonight, a city of Mobile animal control officer fired this afternoon. This for allegedly beating and abusing at least one dog. Fox 10 News got a tip about the alleged incident, which, according to Port Authority police, happened earlier this month. I tied a finger digging for answers all afternoon long. He's now live at the city animal shelter with the story you'll see only on Fox 10 News tonight. Tyler. Yeah, for animal lovers, the allegations are disheartening. Lenise and Byron, this police report I obtained exclusively says in Mobile, a city of Mobile animal control officer not only kicked but also hit at least one dog. Right now, that animal control officer was fired today, and tonight he tells me he believes he was wrongfully terminated. Today, at the City of Mobile Animal Shelter, business as usual, just hours after one of their animal control officers was fired, allegedly for cruelty to a dog. This November 10th police report from the Alabama State Port Authority says City of Mobile Animal Control Officer Christopher Dressel was at the port to pick up two dogs. The dogs started barking at Dressel, and that's when a Port Authority police officer saw Dressel kick one of them and then strike it with enough force to break the leash and cause the dog to defecate. The port police officer then stepped in and ordered Dressel to get into his city truck. Port police then loaded the dogs up for him. The Alabama State Port Authority released this statement saying in part, the Port Authority's police officer witnessed an animal control officer abusing the animals and immediately intervened to stop the abuse. Our port police took steps to protect the animals. The port authority says the dogs in question weren't acting aggressive toward any port police officers. Dressel, who's worked at the animal shelter for a year and a half, told Fox 10 News over the phone that he feels he shouldn't have been fired because his life was threatened. Port police say there is video of this incident, but they have already handed it over to Mobile Police for their investigation. It is important to note that no uh, important to point out that Dressel has not been charged with any crime, but MPD is investigating. We're live tonight outside the city of Mobile Animal Shelter. Tyler Finger at Fox 10 News.